In this episode, we will make a copy of a, of a part in Solid Edge. We will do this by using the Design Manager. Using the Design Manager will make it possible to copy both the part and the drawing of that part. Both will be copied at the same time. I have created two files already. A part called Tube and then I made a drawing of that part. Now to open the Design Manager, you can right click any file made by Solid Edge. So in this case, case we will right click the tube, <clears throat> the tube drawing I mean. Make sure you right click the drawing, select Design Manager. This is the Design Manager. <clears throat> it comes with, uh, with Solid Edge as default. As you can see here, we get the, get the draft and the part. Let's try to close this down and see what happens if you just open the part in Design Manager. When you, when, you, when you do that on the part level, you don't get the drawing. You have to search for it to find it. So we don't want to do that. So make sure to open the, the draft or the drawing in, uh, in Design Manager. Okay, to, um, to make a copy, we just select both files, then click Save As. Now these fields become available. Here we can type a file name and a location. <clears throat> As default, we get the current file name and the current uh, directory or the location. We can also change the title if we want to. <clears throat> The file name is red. It's because uh, there's already a file with that name in that uh, directory. And that's fine because that's the current name. So let's just change this to YouTube. You do the same down here. We can change the directory if we want to. And let's change the file name as well. YouTube. You can copy and paste well. Now we have made some changes, but we need to click this perform action button to uh, to perform those changes. So click this. And Solid Edge has now um, made a copy of this file along with, um, with the draft. It's still in the same location. So let's close this down and take a look. There we have the new file. We can open that. You can see here we have the new file and the new the title field as well. Close this. Let's um, let's open the new tube in uh, in Design Manager. Here we go. <clears throat> in here we can select both files files again, and then click Move. And now we can move it to a new look. And then I want to place it in the, the other folder. Now both has been changed. See here. I want to, if you do some changes and you regret that, you can click up here, clear action. And that will, uh, will cancel what, uh, what you were trying to do. I'll do the same again. Mark both. Click move. I will uh, just cancel this and I can change the location manually if I want to and I'm fine with the rest so let's try to move the file click here perform action and that will uh, move the file now we have the old file here in the 80 folder if we go back and open the 90 folder now you can see the file has been moved. And that's how you cop how you copy and move files in Solid. Remember to like and subscribe for more videos like this. I also added a link to our course in the description. Feel free to take a look. In the course you will learn uh, the most uh, basic features in Solid Edge in a more structured way. It's made for beginners and cover a lot of material.
Uh, that was the end of this episode. Hope you learned something new. Feel free to post questions and comments below. I'll try to answer them all.